This is the F-35 Lightning, and here's why it exists. This the F-35 must be prepared to face any threat since it is the backbone of the U.S. Air Force. But how exactly do its stealth features work, and how effective are they? The F-35 Lightning II was named one of the most stealthy aircraft ever to fly. The fifth-generation fighter jet's ability to remain stealthy is key to its efficacy. Every bit of stealth is required for the F-35 to survive in contested airspace, in an era of strong air defense and radar technology, and with near-peer opponents with advanced military capabilities, such as China and Russia. The U.S. Air Force physically hand-paints its fifth-generation aircraft to achieve that stealth. One paint pressure at a time, the F-35. The F-35 is a modest aircraft at 51 feet long and 35 feet wide, especially if you have to hand. Paint it with a radar absorbing coating. The classified chemical mixture took hours and hours to prepare and put appropriately on the aircraft by specially trained and qualified aircrew. The instructions in the manual cannot simply be read. Who can do it and inspect it is subject to rules. We take doing it right extremely seriously because so much depends on us. We take pride in being specialists in our field. The section chief of the 388th Maintenance Squadron, Master Sergeant John Knowles, stated in a news release that there is unquestionably an art to what we do. It's crucial to understand that each F-35 Lighting II has a unique coat of paint because stealth doesn't necessarily equate to being invisible. Instead, stealth makes an aircraft more difficult to detect and track by hostile radar. The actual airplane can still be seen with the unaided eye. The panels go through a very labor-intensive process of several coatings just to get rid of the latches and cover the fasteners. The final goal is to strike a compromise between keeping the panel's complete functionality and its correct material covering. According to Staff Sergeant Matthew Hicks, a low visible craftsman with the 419th Maintenance Squadron, this is the work that is performed the most frequently in the shop, while also covering many of the processes for many of the processes for many of their responsibilities inside the unit. The unique coating, sometimes referred to as low observable technology, makes it difficult for an enemy to identify, track, or target using radar or missiles. Painting is my favorite aspect of the job because it resembles art in the F-35. According to Airman First Class Anders Speranza, a low observable journeyman at the 388th Maintenance Squadron, you get to see it from the beginning to the conclusion. To prevent equipment from corroding, which might increase maintenance times or potentially result in an accident, the coating must cover every surface, even in locations that receive little sunshine. The Air Force's future, the F-35, is the foundation around which the Air Force has built its entire near-term strategy, so it must operate as planned and counter any known or even unidentified threats. The Pentagon intends to buy approximately 2450 aircraft total across all three versions. Our future fighter force and ability to dominate the air will be built on the F-35 Joint Strike Fighter. Full-spectrum domination is crucial for achieving air superiority. In upcoming battles, our fighter force is designed to outperform major rivals, and the F-35 and its fifth-generation capabilities are a significant component. The Air Force Chief of Staff, General CQQ, Brown Jr., has spoken about the F-35.